Yo, what it do, YouTube? It's your boy, Gento. I've been meaning for some time to make a video on this specific topic, and the longer I've waited, the more and more that I've seen it happen, and I'm tired of this, and I, I really don't want you guys to fall victim to online scams. Now, I feel like I can honestly tell you guys head on about online scams, because when I was your age, about 14, 15, I fell victim to online scams. A long, long time ago, I fell in love with this game called RuneScape. And RuneScape, if you've ever played it, you'll know that it will take hours upon hours, days upon days, weeks upon weeks to get your desired 99 skill. So I downloaded this program to skip up and speed up the process. I never personally gave my account info to anybody. But when I downloaded the program, which looked legit, which looked a thousand percent accurate, and it looked like it would do the things that I needed it to do, I thought I was good. So I downloaded the program, typed in my username, my password, Password. Unfortunately, when I got home from school, I was in for a rude awakening. All of my items, my coins, my dragon armor, party hats. Party hats and dragon armor are, are like millions and millions of coins for those that haven't played RuneScape before. All of that stuff was gone and that was the only time I've ever fell victim to online scams. Was it entirely my fault? You could say that. I didn't listen to the rules, the number one warning. It says never give your account info to anybody. I thought I was good because that, that generator, it really did look legit, but no, it wasn't legit. But here's the thing, with my situation, I didn't have anybody telling me head on, never, ever, 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 ever give your account info away. If anybody online asks for your, your info or promises you this generator, I guarantee all they want to do is rob you of your account and what your account holds. That's all. If you ever contact legit support from anywhere, Microsoft, T-Mobile, Verizon, Comcast, anybody. They will never ask you for your account info. So here's the thing that's happening now, this epidemic, this terrible, terrible thing that's happening to a lot of guys in the 2K community. I say the 2K community because I feel comfortable saying something that I'm actually a part of, but it does also happen amongst Madden communities, FIFA, any community you think of, there's someone out there preying on these younger kids that haven't experienced that yet. These younger kids are falling victim each day due to online scams, but I'm really hoping that this video reaches some of you guys so you don't fall victim. Now, all I can do is spread awareness. It's up to you to actually listen. Here's a prime example. On Twitter, there's a lot of people falling victim to these fake 2K support accounts. They're promising free Ruby Jordans, free pink diamond Iversons. He's not even out yet free million MT bonuses, none of that stuff is legit. They'll tell you click on a link and next thing you know, that link is either gonna ask you for your password and anything like that and they'll promise to just log on to your account and just drop the stuff off. But just like in my situation when I was younger, that isn't gonna happen. They wanna get into your account just so they can sell your items, quick sell them for the lols, the lols, the ha ha moments. But it's not funny at all because these kids, they don't know any better. And it's not even the kids. I, I don't wanna just make it seem like it's kids getting scammed. There's adults and teenagers. Anybody can fall victim. So it's no real age limit on who can get scammed and who's immune from getting scammed. Trust me, it can happen to anyone. So if anybody asks you for your account, anybody says they're gonna do a giveaway. And if they say they're gonna do a giveaway, they are either two things, they're either legit or they're gonna ask you for your password. Me, I do giveaways, but I've never asked anybody for their password because I don't need to give anybody their password. Anybody that's legit doing anything, they're not gonna ask you for your password. And if there's an account out there that looks a little fishy, like. There's fake YMD Gento accounts. Look at the followers. Uh, that's another telltale sign. If you see a fake account, they're not gonna have that many followers because chances are they just made the account today. Maybe it's a backup account, something, an account that they don't really care about. And they're gonna probably have less than less than a hundred followers. So that's another telltale sign. It's just a few things to really look out for. Now I hope this really did help you guys. If you have any more questions. Let me know in the comments down below. Don't fall victim, man. I really hope you guys listen to this video, spread the awareness, like this video, share it with a friend. I'm just tired of seeing good guys falling victim to scams by bad people. 